Dr. Jang's Play Math. Hello, my Play Math friends. It's Dr. Jang. I'm so glad you're here. Are you curious about the exact size of different animals? Today's book is gonna show a variety of animals or their parts as actual size. Don't forget to watch all the way through, because when I finish the book, fun after reading activity will follow. Are you ready for a story? Actual size by Steve Jenkins. Did you ever look a giant squid in the eyes? Have you shaken hands with a gorilla or been face to face with a tiger? All of the animals in this book are shown in actual size, so you can see how you measure up to creatures, both large and small. The Atlas Maw is so large that it is often mistaken for a bird. Wingspan, twelve inches. The dwarf. Goby is the smallest of all fish. Length, one third inch. The giant squid lives deep in the ocean, where its enormous eyes help it see in the dim light. Body and tentacles, up to fifty-nine feet long. Eyes, twelve inches across. The Alaskan brown bear is the largest meat-eating animal that lives on land. Height, thirteen feet. Weight, one thousand seven hundred pounds. Here's the largest bird, an ostrich, with its egg. Height, up to nine feet. Weight. Three hundred forty pounds. A two-foot-long tongue. This must be a giant anteater, snacking on its favorite food, termites. Body and tail, seven feet long. Weight, eighty-five pounds. The Goliath bird eater tarantula is big enough to catch and eat birds and small mammals. Legs, twelve inches across. The saltwater crocodile, the world's largest reptile, is a man eater. Length, twenty-three feet. The Goliath frog lives in Africa. It's big enough to catch and eat birds and rats. Length, thirty-six inches with legs extended. Weight, seven pounds. This is too close to a great white shark. Length, twenty-one feet. Weight, six thousand pounds. Teeth. Four inches long. The huge gorilla and the pygmy mouse lemur both have hands a lot like ours. Gorilla, five and a half feet tall, six hundred pounds. Mouse lemur, two and a half inches tall, one ounce. The Siberian tiger is the biggest of the big cats. Length, fourteen feet, nose to tail. Weight, five hundred to seven hundred pounds. The Goliath beetle is the world's heaviest insect. Length, six inches. Weight, three and a half ounces. The rare giant walking stick is the world's longest insect. Length, twenty-two inches. This foot belongs to the largest land animal, the African elephant. Height, up to thirteen feet. Weight, 
as much as fourteen thousand pounds. The giant Gippsland earthworm lives in Australia. Length, thirty-six inches. The end. Let's do a fun after reading activity. To do this activity, you'll need yarn, foam color cubes, and measuring tape. If you don't have foam color cubes, you can use paper clips, Unifix cubes, or blocks instead. First, choose one animal from the book and measure its body part with yarn. Measure the same body part of your kit and compare the size. When comparing the size, encourage kids to use measurement words such as bigger, smaller, shorter, or longer, and so on. Choose another animal and measure its body part with foam color cubes this time. Compare the size with the same body part of your kit. In these two activities, children practice measuring objects using non-standard measuring unit. Once children get used to the activity, you can increase difficulty level by measuring the body parts with measuring tape, which is a standard measuring tool. The key component to this activity is to get the children to understand they can make an approximate guess with non-standard measuring unit, while they can accurately measure with standard measuring unit. Thank you for watching Play Math. To read more math picture books and do after reading activities, subscribe to this channel. See you next time.